Hi everyone, welcome to Apple Tech page. Lot of iPhone and iPad users have been reporting that they cannot save anything on file app. It says the operation not permitted. In this video, I am going to show you how to fix this error. Solution 1 is Software restart your iPhone and iPad. First, open settings app. Now scroll down the screen and tap on general. Again scroll down the screen and tap on shutdown. Now drag the slide to power off slider to turn off your iPhone. Wait for a few seconds and turn on your iPhone by pressing the power button until you see the Apple logo. Solution 2 is first restart your iPhone and iPad. If you are using iPhone 8 and later models, an iPad without home button, then do the following steps to post restart. First, what you have to do is, quickly press and release the volume up button. Next, quickly press and release the volume down button. Finally, press and hold the side or power button until you see the Apple logo. If you are using iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, then do the following steps to post restart. Press and hold the sleep or wake button and volume down button at the same time until you see the Apple logo. If you are using iPhone 6s Plus and earlier models, an iPad with home button, then do the following steps to force restart. Press and hold the home button and sleep or wake button at the same time until you see the Apple logo. Solution 3 is check for software update. To check the software update, your iPhone should be connected to Wi-Fi. Once connected, open Settings app. Next, tap on General. Now tap on Software Update. If software update is available, tap Download and Install. You have to wait until the downloading process is complete. Solution 4 is Reset All Settings. Reset all settings won't delete your personal data. This process will reset your customized settings to default settings. Open settings app. Next, find and tap on general. Now scroll down the screen to bottom and tap reset. Here, tap on reset all settings. Now enter your iPhone's passcode. In the pop-up window, tap Reset All Settings to confirm this process. Thanks for watching. Do like, share and subscribe to Apple Tech page.